photo, it means light. A dash of color from a spray can falls on a surface the way light falls, uh, with hard edges and soft edges. I love it. I love this material. I think I should uh, explore that, that feeling because the materials are, are our companion in the individual effort to, to find an image that, that speaks on its own and that has a lasting meaning. I think a spray as a, as a column of paint moving through the air has a special glamour or a special power. Uh, above all, that it, that it falls on surfaces like light falls on surfaces. That's led me to the use of the stencil idea of uh, an object to interfere with the falling of light and make a shadow there. We see where the spray hits plainly and leaves its own signature. But where it doesn't hit, there's another signature looking up from beneath. I love bright, attention-getting colors. I love red, and I love white and black. I love silver, for example, because it seems to reflect the light that's hitting it, and that's a specially fine thing. Spray gives me all the choices that I would have using a brush or any other tool, but in a special and very speedy way, too, very quick. I love that part of it. It matches my own urgency of working. The use of stencil dawned on me when I realized that spray paint is a, is a perfect way to, uh, to, to create shadows that are specially uh, bright because they cover a bright surface. The colors and forms of my paintings are uh, plainly uh, involved in fortuitous arrangements. That is, unexpected things happen. When you have one grid on top of another grid, they don't match up. They are different. This grid is hiding part of that grid. A rhythm is being set up. It's five against four, something that in music is a very complex thing and leads to strange movements and strange uh, appearances. The gridiron is valuable to me just because there are so many different gridirons and no one of them is the right gridiron. They are all necessary and uh, I don't think of it as a prison or as a cage to hide and conceal and uh, restrict anything. I feel of it as a, as a representation of the totality in its many different forms. The totality of our earth isn't even understood by us. We don't know what's outside the boxes that we do live in and know about. And we should. We should care about those changes and watch for them.